Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we've got three brand new mystery gifts, a brand new Spotlight Terror event, and the next global challenge that will be happening later this week in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. So after getting back from EUIC in London over the weekend, we're trying to catch up with everything that's been going on recently. Firstly, we're gonna kick off with the brand new Spotlight Terror event that will be happening later this week. Featuring Blissey, yes, Blissey will be making a return. We've already had a Spotlight Terror event for Blissey recently, and it was a really good one for giving us high amounts of Terror Shards. This event will be returning Friday the 21st of April and running through to the 23rd, as you can see, and Blissey will be appearing in various Spotlight Terror Raid events, offering up a huge amounts of Terror Shards, and all of the Blisseys will be all five stars. Of course, as well, if you'd like any best builder videos for this specific event let me know i'm happy to throw some ideas up for you last time out we used ursa ring and it was incredible just to run through an array of different blissey raids so if you'd like to do it we will be obviously going live with the event with all of the details when it happens later this week and we'll cover a solo build that makes it just as easy as that ursa ring to go through and run through these events as easy as possible alongside the blissey the type Flosion seven star terror raid event will be returning this week as well again over the same time frame from friday the 21st to sunday the 23rd for the second time around so if you missed the first time with the typhlosion raid event you'll be able to go in and get it this time remember it is only once per save file but on top of that if you have already got it you'll be able to go in and just farm the high cost items between this and the blissey event running this weekend it will be a very good time to just get a lot of high cost items, a lot of high value items as well in your game and take advantage of it. And on the back of the Typhlosion Raid finishing on this Sunday evening, we should get news of an update of the next seven star terror raid event that will be happening soon remember that the update for pokemon scarlet and violet that was mentioned earlier this month will be coming in the end of april so we are due that walking wake iron leaves spotlight terror raid event again when that will be though we will have to wait and see but, but hopefully we do get a brand new seven star raid event announced as this one ends but uh, let me know what you think down below will we get a hisuian pokemon for our next seven star raid event i would love to see it but we'll wait and see like i said the announcement for the next one shouldn't be too far off next up is the global challenge we've already had one of these a couple of weeks ago this will be the second global challenge that will be running this coming weekend registration is actually open in your games right now you can go on to the ranked ladder in your game and you can register right up until the day of this event starting which will be friday the 21st and it'll be running over the weekend ending on sunday the 23rd at uh, 4 59 pm ptd so you can translate that into your own time zone and um, you can go in obviously like i said the poker portal battle stadium and then online competitions and register through there this event gives out championship points depending on how well you finish and runs in conjunction with the japan national championship qualifying event but if you're not really into competitive it is worth taking part in this tournament because you can get yourself a nice great ball bag uh, for completing three games you don't need to win those three games you just need to participate in three games and then you'll be able to get the code for this bag which will be distributed in pokemon home after the event closes so that's a nice little one as well and to finish us off today we've got three new brand new mystery gift codes for you to take advantage of in your game and they're not too bad they're not amazing but they're not too bad either the mystery gift codes are on your screen now we'll start off with the first one these mystery gifts will run until october the 2nd 2023 so we've got plenty of time for you to take advantage of these codes and get these items in your game first one up is going to be for 10 rare candies the code will be on the screen and it is level up you want to go into your poker portal down to your mystery gift and get with code or password once you're in here if you just put the level up code in this will give you 10 rare candies in your game for free the next one up is a revive and this is giving you five max revives for this code revive again all running until the 2nd of october and the final one that we've got for today is going to be catch by ball is the code and it will give you a total of 30 different pokeballs you're going to get five nest 
dive dusk timer quick and luxury balls with this card again this one running until the 2nd of october quite a nice mix of mystery gifts for you to take advantage of especially the rare candies and the pokeballs but again if you are starting out a new playthrough or you haven't even started the games yet these codes are quite useful if you're starting out from the beginning of the game once you have access to the poker portal be able to use these codes but for the rest of us that are well deep into our playthroughs a nice little gift just to take advantage of for resources resources while we can so that is everything that we wanted to cover today like i say i've been away at the european international championships over this past weekend so i'm a little late with some of the updates on these but the blissy spotlight terror event will be kicking off later this week with that seven star type flosion for the second time round. the global challenge running at the same time with that and the mystery gifts on top of it so it feels like we're caught up with most things that happened over the weekend while i was away so hope you found today's video useful friends have a great rest of your day if you have found it useful please drop a like do subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with all of our pokemon scholar and violet content we'll be back later this week with the raid videos when they do drop and go live and any further updates in between on those events thank you so much for tuning in have a great rest of your day make sure you take care of yourself and i will see you all in another video very soon so until then take care bye bye